Hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you my everyday makeup look. So I start up using this Too Faced Prime to Poreless Foundation Primer. It just prepares my face for the foundation and makes sure my makeup lasts all day. I just use it with my fingers and blend it out with my hands. It's the only primer I've ever used. Today I'm using my Dior Air Flash Foundation. It's a spray foundation and I'm in the lightest color. I just shake it up and spray it all over my face. But um, actually I got it on my shirt, so um, I recommend not do it, doing it before you actually put on what you're going to wear. So next I just take this Sigma Dual Fiber Brush and blend it out the rest of the way with that. You want to make sure that your foundation is very blended and you don't have splotches anywhere. So next I'm going to take the Tarte Amazonian Clay Concealer and I'm in light and I just use it out of the tube and put it on around my under eyes to conceal them and on any problem areas that I have and anywhere that I notice that I get red. So I'm just using my fingers to pat the concealer into my skin and kind of blend it out. I prefer using my fingers over a brush just because they're warm and I feel like warming up the concealer it just makes it easier to work with and it blends it better into the skin and covers up more. So I prefer my fingers over a brush. So next I'm just taking the MAC Studio Fix Foundation Powder and I'm taking a Sigma large powder brush and just applying it all over my face to set my foundation and concealer. I really love this powder because it's so smooth and it just feels so nice on my face and it actually gives me a bit more coverage. Also, when using this powder, I noticed that my skin does not get oily at all throughout the day and I don't really have a problem with oil when I use it. So next I'm just taking the Urban Decay Primer Potion to prime my eyes for eyeshadow and I'm just using my fingertips and patting it on my eyelid and blending it out smoothly. to reach for every day is my Urban Decay Vice palette and what I love so much about this palette is there's just such a wide variety of color choices and just so many options you could choose from. So the first color I'm taking is called Echo Beach. It's kind of a champagne -y color and I'm taking it with the Sigma shader brush and I'm just applying this all over my lid and for the sake of time I'm just going to be doing one eye because I knew this video was already going to be very long. So what I'm doing is basically just patting the color into my lid and then sweeping it to kind of blend it because I don't want any fallout and this is kind of a shimmery color. So next I'm going to take the color Nevermind and it's kind of a smoky brown color and I'm taking it with the Sigma Tapered Blending Brush and I'm just going to place this in my crease and blend it out to my outer eye. This is a dark color, you want to make sure that it's very well blended. But after you're done blending it all, you want to take a highlight color. I'm using Anonymous, and I'm just taking it with the Sigma 
large shader brush and applying it to my brow bone and inner corner to give my eyes some highlight and just make them pop. Next, I take MAC Black Track Fluid Line with the Sigma Angled Eyeliner Brush and I just apply it to my upper lash line, but I went out of focus when I was doing this. And then after that, I just take my eyelash curler, I just have a red bottom one, and I apply my mascara. I'm using Lancome Hypno Star Mascara, and I actually really, really love this mascara. It makes my eyelashes look so good in my opinion, and it just makes them so curly and long. Next, I use Urban Decay 24-7 Glide-On Eyeliner Pencil in Perversion to outline my waterline. This is my favorite eyeliner ever because it's so dark and creamy. After that, I take the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer, and I just have the little mini one, and a Sigma Angled Contour Brush, and I contour my cheeks, my temples, and my jawline. you want to give your face definition but you want to make sure your bronzer is also well blended because you don't want it to look like there's just dirt on your face or that your face is dirty so make sure you blend it well next I just took the NYX blush in pinky it's a very pretty pink color and I took the same contour brush and smiled found the apples on my cheeks and placed it there and blended out however this is where my camera died after that, I just applied the Maybelline Color Whisper in Cherry on top to my lips. I absolutely love that color. And here's the finished look. Hope you enjoyed watching. Thanks so much.